Hi, I'm Valder Beebe, and I host the Valder Beebe Show on FM radio and internet television. I am famously known for that celebrity interview, which I conduct by cell phone, in studio, or satellite media tours. Go to ValderBeebeShow.com, YouTube.com slash Show, or our partnership network with Business in the Black, which is BlackSuccessAcademy.com, and click on the Valder BB Show channel. I'll see you there. I am so delighted I get to talk to you, the actor, Nestor Carbonell, uh, and the producer, Carlton Cuse. Thank you for joining us today. Uh, th- thank you for having us. We're happy to be here. Well, we get to talk about one of my, my audience favorites. They told me how much they love Bates Motel. So you're the executive producer, Carlton. Let me, ta- let me start with you. You know, you've taken this, this uh, period. It was not a period piece. You've taken this genre and you brought it to the 21st century. How do you keep it fresh every week? Well, I think the, um, the idea is Carrie Aaron, um, my fellow writer, and I, uh, we, we really wanted to just take some of the elements from this movie Psycho but tell a modern story about a mother and a son, and this mother loves her son to death. I mean, they have such a close relationship, but he has this flaw in his DNA, which um, you know uh, we know from the movie may lead him to become a serial killer. And we're just hoping against hope that he doesn't become that guy. And And the show kind of explores this relationship and the people in the town around them, including Nestor, who plays the sheriff in this little town of White Pine Bay, Oregon. And um, it's just a wonderful character drama. And I think people who watch the show really get engaged with the um, with the story and with the with the characters. It's interesting that you, you do, especially, yeah, especially if you have any history. I'm sorry, oh, Nestor. No, I was just going to add. Sorry, Valder. I was just going to add that you're right. You, you bring up the notion that it's it's he's sort of uh, hampered by his DNA. But I think the other thing that the show brings it raises a question is how much of it is uh, nature, how much of it is nurture. Right. Because when you have that dysfunctional relationship with a mother, you wonder could it have gone another way uh, had had it not been so dysfunctional. And that's another one of the great things I love about about what you guys have created is is uh, these really strong big questions about you know where 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 does the blame lie. That's great. Let me ask you again, Carlton. You've made this genre that really scare people. Uh, what do you want my audience to walk away with? Because we're already scared. I mean, I I think that um, uh, you know, in a thriller or horrors, the the reason when they work well, it's because you have a lot of empathy for the characters. You really care about them, and really, um, I think the goal here is to make you care about these characters. And I think if you watch this show. Um, you cannot help but fall in love with Norman and Norma and Sheriff Romero and um, some of the other people in the cast. It's, it's, it's a group of people who are really engaging and interesting. And, um, you know, they, they find themselves in tense situations. But because you care about them, then you, you, you might feel worried for them. And that's, I think that's what makes horror work. All right, all right. You know, Nestor, let me ask you, we still remember you from your previous films because you did such a good job. We loved you in Lost. And you've been in many other things, but we loved you in Lost. And now you've got this center stage. Where are you going from here? <laughs> oh, thank you, Valder. Well, the reason uh, I, I got to work with uh, Carlton, I had the privilege of working with Carlton in Lost. He, he and Damon Lindelof created the show. And uh, and so I had the the uh, honor of getting a, a call from Carlton to... to uh, to join him on Bates when uh, when he, he started on it, so uh, so no, it's been a phenomenal ride. That was an, another extremely great experience, and uh, it uh, yeah, it has forever changed my life. Uh, um, it, there's such wonderful creative rides, and on Lost we got to live in Hawaii. You add that to the mix, so you know it, it uh, it's it's been an amazing, and I look forward to working in TV um, as well as in film. And thanks also to Carlton and Carrie. I've now gotten a chance to direct uh, on Bates, and, and I'm looking forward to other opportunities, uh, hopefully beyond that. 
Well, you guys are great. Let me ask you, when can we? When do you want us to watch you coming up? The uh, fifth and final series, the fifth and final season of the show is airing Monday nights at 10 p.m. Eastern and Pacific on A and E. We'll be there because you guys are doing a great job. Thank you for being my guest today on the Valder BB Show. It's been my pleasure. Thank you, Valder. Thank you so much, Valder.